Hi everyone, welcome back to another interview series. My name is Meher from Newfoundland and Labrador. And today I have the privilege to interview Alex here from Austin, Texas. Hi Alex, how are you doing? Good, good, how are you doing? Thank you for being here. So Alex, as a practitioner, he always strives to provide innovative solutions, top-notch content marketing and game-changing strategies while providing the highest level of service. He enjoys content marketing, recruitment marketing, employer branding, and attending new events, providing digital strategy, growing and helping out brands via social media and managing campaigns. And outside his work, he's also the co-founder of EB Space Community and one of the many leaders at the employer brand world. So uh, Alex, my first question for you is, so why it is important these days, personal branding, and we know that through social media, a lot of people, job seekers can post about their personal brand. But a lot of times, new immigrants or international students, they don't know what's my personal brand. I don't know. Where can they start? What they can do? Yeah, yeah. I think it's just um, really developing a presence on um, LinkedIn. I mean, mm -hmm. it, and that's, the, that's you know, kind of the catch-all for a lot of the different industries. I mean, it's going to change based off of what you're, you're into. You know, while LinkedIn may be good for, uh, you know, most corporate positions, uh, like the engineering world, uh, it, it matters more to have a presence on, on Twitter. Um, yeah. Twitter, you know, GitHub, Stack Overflow, then you can dive into Dribbble when it comes to designers. Uh, it really depends if you want to be niche or not, but um uh, just engaging with uh you know with those different uh platforms and communities and sharing your thoughts um it's mm -hmm. it, i think it could be a bit daunting but mm -hmm. getting out there sharing your thoughts uh, that's that's the first step right uh, yeah. we've all been there before and once you take that first step i think after that it's uh you know you you, you grow once you start doing that yeah so it is important to know who you are what are your values and then you can talk about them as kind of your personal brand on LinkedIn, right? Well, it was that. And I mean, what do you what do you want to be known for? Mm -hmm. um, I've shared quite a few things over the years where I think everyone is trying to be someone else. Like, I can't be you. You can't be me. You know, there's yeah. things that yeah. we do that make us special. Mm -hmm. And identifying, okay, do you want to do you want to be known as just sharing hot takes? Okay, that's that's fine. You can go that route. But then yeah. you get questioned on, okay, what it is if you actually know what you're talking about mm -hmm. um, or, you know, if you like to uh, reshare articles and kind of give your, you know, your Inspired. thoughts on that. I mm -hmm. think that's the quickest way, right? Because yeah. you're not coming up with the, with the blogs or videos, yeah. you're just sharing your thoughts and okay. You know, it's a bit of commentary. I think that's the easiest way to do something. And then you kind of get a feel for, okay, the people you're connected with, you getting uh, likes, shares, engagement, yeah. whatever you you're after. Mm -hmm. And that will kind of, you know, set you on your path from there. Yeah, those are great tips, Alex. Thank you very much. So for the audience watching or listening for the first time, I'm going to ask Alex a couple of questions and I'm going to post them on a daily basis, kind of a journey with us. You can like, share, put your comment on each video. So tune in next time for another great question with Alex.